Hey there, I'm Mr. Lagging. Welcome to Mr. Hop's Playhouse 2. I didn't really read the description, so I can't explain it that well to you, but the best way I can explain it is we're probably going to be chased around by a killer bunny that's possessed by a demon. Alright. Glad I know that now. Starting off in a big, spooky, dark house. That's always great. The thing on the top left is probably how loud I'm being. Which if I run, I'm not that loud. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, okay. Uh... That's a weird way to walk down those steps. <laughs> Ow. Alright, well, I don't see any toys this time, so it can't be that hard. Probably. Nice. You just want me to put, like, the wardrobe in front of the door? What, what, is, what does it want me to do? Is it just telling me I can push stuff? Alright, that's cool. I almost ran back into those spikes. That's not good. Wait, why does my sound meter go up and stay up? I'm not sure that doesn't make any sense. You know, I'm just saying. Hey there, rabbit boy. Oh well, this this hallway is a bit longer than I remember. Hmm, I'm getting flashbacks to the first game. This hand is coming at me very fast. Too fast, in fact. Was I a witch? Esther, we are trying to sleep. Yeah, I'm trying to not get grabbed by a super demon bunny. Blacklands Manor Orphanage, United Kingdom, 1952. Did you have a bad dream again, Esther? It's yes, it was terrifying. Dream, Isaac. It's the same dream. Over and over again. Maybe it means something. Maybe it means you're going crazy. Shut up, Molly. Crazy, Molly. Here you are, kids. More things for you to make a mess with. Thank you, Beverly. Uh, toys. Can't wait to. Hmm. So that bunny looks a little creepy, doesn't he? Whoa. <laughs> That's what I think. They're adorable. I'm going to call mine Miss Bow. Why not Kung Fu Panda? Mr. Stripes. What are you going to call yours, Esther? Mr. Hop. Demon thing. This is my favorite toy. I call it Demon Thing. Title screen. Chapter one: Hide and Seek. Objective added. I, you know, I can say there's definitely a bit more to this one than there was in the last one, which is a good thing. And there's a lot of kids in here. It is an orphanage, so, you know, kind of expect there to be a lot of kids here. I'm also apparently completely deathly silent when it's daytime. I must be able to sneak on people really good. Esther! Down here! I'm coming! I'm ready for the ballroom dance. Wait, where were you? All I heard was you say down here, so I went down. I don't think this is the right way. Ooh, coin. Yes, please. I think we have a crack in our wall. You might want to check this place for mice next time. Who is you? I have no clue. Oh, hey, there you are. Seek with us? That wouldn't be fair. You can see Esther's big head from anywhere. Oh, Molly. <laughs> so funny, Molly. <laughs> Don't forget beautiful and clever. <laughs> you go count by the lift. We will hide in the library. What is this, the lift? You know, I've been here for a while. I just had, uh, I have dementia, I think. Yeah, that's why. Oh, a coin. 
Yeah, this is a really big place. Too big of a place. It needs to be smaller. Oh. You're saying I just explored the whole house in the lift. I just had to walk to the left. That would have been so much better if you would have just told me that. This lift has been out of order for two weeks. Please telephone an engineer, Bev. Alright. Three, two, one. Coming! Ready or not? Mr. Hop, you wait here. What, you're not gonna take Mr. Hop with you? He can sniff out people like it's nobody's business. Probably. Oh, hey, there's, uh, the two that I just already forgot the name of. Let's see. Uh, where's the... Can I grab a book? What? Oh, I can just push it. What am I pushing this? Uh, good exercise? Maybe? I like a coin. I love coins. Coins make the world go round. Oh, hey. No, not fair. Oh, sucks to suck, nerd. Exactly. I agree with Molly. <laughs> huh. Are you on top of that, or... Is that... <laughs> I, I think you think cheated. You're allowed to move to different hiding spots. It's not fun playing with a cheat. A cheat? You two are lucky. I am even playing with you right now. Watch Can out! There's a nun behind you. The noise down. No. Don't you know this is a library? My yes, bad. Miss Beverly. Awful children. It's not like anybody else is in here. We can go somewhere else. I'll go get Mr. Hop. Well, time to go grab Mr. Hop. Probably hasn't moved. Oh no, he's moved. Oopsie, I must have left you too close to the edge. I, I don't think that's how that works. I think even if you did leave him too close to the edge, he would stay perfectly still. Hey buddy, you got a lazy eye? Oh my god, Mr. Hobson's got... He's playing the piano. My worst nightmare. Don't wake the others. I did it. I woke the other. <laughs> I, you know, maybe I won't wake the others this time. Okay, that was very loud. My bad. Good thing you guys sleep really well. Matrons are... Uh, I forgot to read that. I was too focused on the thing that was just in the... Actually, can I go look at it? It hasn't killed everyone, right? So I gotta find Mr. Hop. Where's Mr. Hop? Oh, I could have just looked at this to find the lift, couldn't I? And you know. Oh, coin. That's great. <laughs> Didn't even suspect a thing. It's not like I was directly in front of her. Another coin. I'm just crazy with finding all these coins. Call me the coin collector, because I collect the coins. I would go directly to Mr. Hop, but those coins also sound pretty nice. Of course, I ran straight into her. Do I keep all my coins though? No, I don't. On my way to collect every single coin yet again. Why? There are rats in here. I was correct. <laughs> Told you you should have checked it out. Oh no, she's coming up here. 
And that one's gonna turn around. Is there a coin in here? Damn right, there's a coin in here. How do I get that coin? All vinyl records could be returned here, please. Okay. Uh, can I move this table? You're goddamn right, I can't. I can't jump on it, though. What's the point of moving it if I can't jump on it? Oh, I can jump on it now. Now that I put the chair there. That makes sense. It doesn't really. Mr. Hobbs. I hear you, Mr. Hobbs. That wasn't Mr. Hobbs. Weren't you just in the bedroom with all the other kids? Hmm, kind of weird. Anyways, guess I'll go talk to Mr. Hobbs after I look at this paper. Please clean up after yourself if you use the kitchen. Thank you. Alright, uh, Mr. Hobbs, are you in here? Hey, Mr. Hobbs. Uh, how did you get all the way down here? He must have ran. How did he not get found? Um. Uh. <laughs> Oh, no. I don't know what you're playing at, Esther. If I catch you out of bed again, you'll be spending the night in the cellar. Do I make myself clear? You mean with all the booze? Bed. Now. All right. Guess I'll go to bed. <laughs> I guess I'll just go to bed. The six. Surprised I didn't wake everyone up with that. <laughs> I just walked through all the toys. Hmm. Mr. Hops, could that pop? Okay. Well, you know what they say. Another day, another. Man, I really. I think tonight I should just go back to bed. Hey. Mr. Hop, I assume that's you. Ow. Will anything happen if I cross you? No. And it seems like nothing's happening. God. I think he's here now. He's here now. And he moves fast. I don't even know. He's on the second floor. I was about to say, I don't even think he's on the second floor. He was. He was very much on the second floor. Oh, when I press tab, it doesn't tell me what I need to do. Boing. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Oh, that's what that sound was. Ooh, that was close. Oh, here's another one. Here's another one. I got two more to find. I assume the last one would be in this room. Because that seems like where it would be. Oh. It kills me. That's what happens. Let's go. Cool. Grab that. Don't get hit in the head. Nope. Haha, I got you that time. And you didn't get me that time. Got it. Hmm. Um. I don't really know what to do now. There's a. Ow. There's a sound, so I'm gonna go to it. What might that sound be? Fire. Fire is that sound. This also seems like there's an extra floor here. To put this fire out before the whole house is burnt down. Nah, that'll be okay. Ow. Boop a doo, don't get stabbed because one more stab and I'm dead. I'm gonna go grab water from the bow. What was that? Okay, that's fine. I need something to collect the water. 
Oh look, a convenient bucket in the room. Guess I'll go fill it up with water in the bathroom. And now we're gonna fight fire with a bucket of water by throwing it on it. Hmm. Hi, Mr. Hop. Kind of weird how you turned into like, like, like you were a pole, and then you turned into a big creepy monster thing, and then you kind of ate my face. What do those symbols mean? And why do I keep seeing them? Have you asked the symbols? Maybe they know what they mean. Look for Molly and Isaac. What if I don't want to look for Molly and Isaac? Oh, I Molly, found him. you put Mr. Hop in the kitchen last night and got me in trouble. What? That wasn't me. Why would I go anywhere near Mr. Hop when I have Miss Bo? Are you sure you weren't just sleepwalking? You know, maybe if you didn't act like such a princess and tried to be nice, we all might actually like you. Oh. 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 Oh, okay. You should go apologize. No, thank you. No, I guess we will. New objective added. Apologize to Molly before the big creepy bear that she has mauls her to death. I'm gonna look around the house real quick for coins. Not a single coin was found, so it's time to go apologize to Molly. Which is probably down and not to the right, but I could find coins down here. Molly, where did you go? Where did you go, Molly? And do you happen to have any coins with you? I'd be very glad to take those off your hand. That is not Molly. That is another kid. Hey, Billy. Have you seen Molly anywhere? That is hmm. Billy. I'll tell you where she is if you get my ball back from the storage room. Miss Beverly confiscated it. Uh, are you serious? You know we're not allowed in that part of the house. Well, I guess you don't want to know where Molly is then. Okay, fine. Right, I don't. It's not that important. I don't need to find Molly if I have to get in trouble for it. Oh, hey. Aside from being a prestigious attraction for tourists during summer, Blackland Manor is currently operating as a large orphanage estate. Many of the children that rest here have lost their parents who were given up the circumstance of war. Built in the 1800s, many of the locales worked on the, sur uh, worked on the surrounding land. Blackland's a town with dark history. Oh, is this... Is this the room that they were talking about? Alright. I don't know how I was caught. <laughs> but that's cool. What? What? Ah, I didn't get caught that time. Okay, time to continue forward. And maybe you find that stupid kid's ball. After I continue to the right a bit more. Wow. There's a glorious art museum in this orphanage. Why? It's a great question. Ooh, piece of paper. Do not allow the American boy to have a football. Kicking it around indoors is unacceptable. Oh no! You don't see anything? Esther? What? She was reading her book though. That makes no sense. Who's there? Mm, I don't know. Have you asked the statue? I was making it so overly complicated for absolutely nothing. Who's there? Esther? 
All right, I'm out of the room. And uh, what was that? Was there something there? Am I insane? Hey, Mr. Hobbs, what are you doing in here? Uh, can we not like go over there and grab him? Jesus. <laughs> Yes, and a chiropractor. Not a chiropractor, therapist. I don't think a chiropractor helps with mental issues. <laughs> yes. I have no clue how I'd get that coin in that office, but it's probably something that I have to do later. You're crazy if you think I'm getting it right now. A new girl called. D has just joined us. Please introduce her to the other children. After I grab this coin, I'm robbing this whole soul dry and they don't even know it. And I got your freaky hey, you got wooden ball. ball. Can you please tell me where Molly is now? Well, I don't actually know for certain. What? I'm gonna beat this. But if I know Molly, she is probably in the second floor bedroom. Uh, east wing. Thank you, I guess. Time to go find Molly. Hmm, Molly. Miss Bo, why are you in here all by yourself? Hello, Molly. You're not dead, are you? Okay, I uh, found one of these things. Oh, I'm running. Oh, this actually isn't that intense. Right now. This is actually really easy. Absurdly easy. Way too easy. I'm so glad I'm like 20 times faster than Mr. Hops. Oh god. Oh god. Uh, well, I say he cheated. Alright, let's try that again. And this time, I will not die. Because, okay, that's a bad, bad start. But it's alright. Okay, really bad. How do you even jump over those uh, big, tall ones? I don't know how you would jump over those. Oh my god, I actually did it. I, I am uncomfortably close to this guy right now. Medallion found. I don't know if there was more of those. No, I think that was the first one. I think that was the first one. Oh, I'm just back here now. There's Molly, I think. Is that Molly? Hey, Dee, have you seen no, Molly? You hear it? The whispering. The evil no. one rhymes these halls. There's something among us. There's an imposter? Also, no, I think you're absolutely insane. I don't know, I mean, you're not that insane. I did just have a nice little race with a big spooky bunny. And that is a hand. I'm not sure if I want to walk this way. Now Isaac is gone. Esther, for goodness sake! We know that Molly and Isaac are hiding somewhere, and they will be dealt with accordingly. Now, stop your worrying and get to bed. No, they're probably just dead. I'm, I'm gonna be perfectly honest with you, they're probably just dead. They are definitely dead. Did you see that? They are not alive. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. This house makes me uncomfortable. If I go back, will she be gone? Would the, you know, actually, let me go back and check. Oh, a coin. Guess I should continue checking this house. 
I really just came down here because I wanted to go to the, li the library and see if I could grab that coin that Miss Beverly was hiding, but I cannot enter anywhere. Well, it's time to go to sleep. Uh, don't mind me guys, I'm just going to bed. Next to Mr. Hop. The Loop. Why is there a pedestal here? Can I- I can't do anything with it. Can only touch it when it's straight ahead of me. Do not move, you say? I'm not moving. I can tell you I am not moving. In fact, I can assure you that I'm not moving. Yeah, okay, time to just skedaddle. Wow. You've got a pretty set of teeth there. And nice eyes that remind me of the solar eclipse. Oh, I have to be quiet. Okay, then. Can I run with this? I can't run with this. I just have to slowly walk all the way over to the diamond. And I have to go to the triangle one. Oh, wait a minute. It stays. So I just have to go over there and get the triangle one and bring it all the way back to the start. Plop. Now I just gotta go all the way back, which will be easy, and I'll have no interruptions. Okay, the square one should be easy, because it's like right there. What? What? You've got to be kidding me, man. Well, I've now seen every death animation, so that's pretty cool. <laughs> Ooh, that was close. Well, now the door over there is unlocked. I just have to go over there. Why can they not see me if I don't move? Are they like T-Rexes? Oh my god, a coin. It was totally worth it. This feels like the kind of place I'd be murdered in. Okay, I thought I was gonna get murdered there. I thought I was gonna be proven correct. This is one long hallway. Oh, it's looping. It's looping, isn't it? Ah, oh, well, you know, as my grandma always said, looping hallways are not good when you hear that music. Oh, hey, I was actually able to open one of the doors. Glad I kept trying all of them. Yeah, if, if I didn't try that door, I wouldn't have been able to open it that time. Hmm. Boop, 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 boop. Nice. Follow me. I don't know who you are, but I'm, you know, I've been walking through this hallway quite a while. That picture changed. That's not the same picture. Uh huh. You thought you could kill me with that, didn't ya? They're probably gonna kill me with the falling chandelier. Oh, that picture is a lot different now. Down here. Hi, Mr. All right. 
Mm, a bead necklace. What does that mean? Hmm, well, this is a weird chandelier. There's not even a light on it. Is that me? That's not me. Is that D? That, that girl that heard bells? Did she hear bells? You are perfect. Oh, thank you. You're not. Because you just disappeared. Okay, a burning house in the background. Me and... Wait, no, that isn't a burning house. They start pointing to, for the little girl to go away, I think. No, thank you. I'm good. Man, that's kind of weird. Anyways, um, I gotta continue. Oh, wait, maybe there's a coin in the room she came out of. I can't grab it. Well, um... She deserved it? I don't know if she did, but... You know, who am I to say who deserves something or not? Ow. There's nothing in this room this time. It's an empty room. Oh no, the girl's about to be burned, just like I was at the start of the game. Especially with all this fire in the background. Yep, she just, she just got caught on fire. Burned the witch. Wow, they all just disappear. It hurts. I assume it would. I would like if you were not at that window. I'll just walk past and pretend like I didn't see you. Ow. Then three little golden dolls. Brown dolls? I took them all. Mm-hmm. Yeah, would you like to tell me more about that? You look like you're pretty happy about it. Oh, and all the creepy music stopped, and now there's just three dolls staring at me. Creepily, of course. Chandler's are gonna fall this time. No, it's okay. Give yourself to us. Uh, no, I am a person of... Hey... That's not good. Whispers. Oh, and now it's getting scary. Oh, damn. I can't just walk through all the toys this time. Where are you two? Dead. In the basement. Go down there so you can find our bodies. No, I, that's whispers. I do hear whispers. And they are getting louder. And I am gonna run. All the whispering. I don't know. Okay, I don't think I can just go straight across the top to find the whisper. I hear noises at night. It seems to be getting worse. Beverly insists it's the children, but I believe it's something else. I keep my faith that I am protected. But I am not. 
I am very dead. Give these kids like... Oh no! The Six. These six symbols are a modern mystery known as the Six. They were first discovered on ancient hieroglyphics worn by Pharaoh as medallions on a necklace. The Six have since been seen on many illustrations throughout history with the latest discovery in 1876. Their existence, use, and relevance to royalty power remains unknown. Well, I can't actually enter there. I'm dead no matter what. Oh, secret. Oh, God, okay. I don't feel like this would be that hard, actually. Although I said that about the last one. Nope. Special stage. Here it goes, baby. I'm the fastest around. You've never seen a parkour master quite as good as me. I'm actually so good that I'm faster than you can keep up with. Ow. Okay, that was actually really close. Too close. No! Well, that's twice that's happened. Medallion found. Did I miss one? Nope, still on track. Alright, I need to get in that room that that one maid is blocking, but how do I get in there without her noticing? Like, how do I drag her away? Oh, I bet you I know what I have to do. I have to play the music. Maybe I could use this. No, no, why did you come this way? That do makes no sense. What what is this? What, what? Oh my god, I hate this. I hate this so much. Alright, the question is, how am I gonna, like, like, where is the room with the records in it? Oh, it was this room. Alright, uh, so I should be able to just go up there and put this in, as long as I don't get caught. Hopefully I don't get caught. Okay. Put the record in here. Hmm. I do say, this is a nice jam. Okay, that's cool. Oh, she just starts walking. Well, time is. Okay, all right. Doesn't matter. Just follow the voices. I I can definitely break this. Don't lie to me. All right. Molly. Isaac, are you in there? Esther, they locked us in here. The key is in Miss Beverly's room. Get us out of here. No, I gotta go all the way to the library. <laughs> Why are they both in there? What did they do wrong? I don't know. You know, if I had to guess, those are just auditory illusions. And that's not actually Isaac and Esther. Those are two... I... Uh, No, I forgot that you can't stop walking down the steps once you start. Okay, I almost walked straight past the side of the spot. This is the perfect chance to get that coin that was in her room, though. How about no? All Esther's walking around at night. If you catch her, take her straight down to the cellar. Alright, I see what's... 
Who was that? I'm not gonna question it. It's probably me. In a future form. Oh, there's a note here. The Entity. This depicted figure is a personification of a powerful deity that rules over the underworld. Satan is Satan. A realm beyond the living. This force, once thought to be the guardian of hope, was banished from the above and sent to the depths of darkness for wrongdoings and corruption. The entity is the embodiment of evil and sin in many religions, writing, and practices. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna go grab a coin. That's the only thing I'm interested in. It's in Beverly's room. That, uh, well, luckily for me, that's not where I'm going. Wait a minute, no, this room changed. Oh, I can't go in there. Meaning that the coin I have to get whenever I have, uh, whenever I have to go grab that kid's balls when I have to get the coin. Oh, time to go back up to the voices. Wait, was there a note there? I didn't read it. The whispering never stops. I'm not comfortable with these patrols anymore. There's something here watching all of us. And his name is me. I'm watching you. Oh, that's not normal. Yeah, I will run the other way. Thank you very much. Whoa, don't say my name. <laughs> you can't open doors. You might be right. Maybe I am going crazy. Oh, I don't know. That was not a hallucination. I can assure you that was not a hallucination. Is a hole still there? No, it's not. Hmm, maybe we are just crazy. There better not be, a, a like, another maid at the end of this hall. That's not a maid. That's not a maid. That's actually a big spooky bunny. Not what I'm looking for. Thank hey, you, Molly and Isaac. I knew it wasn't them. I, I knew that wasn't them. Didn't I, Esther? Come with me now. But Miss Beverly, Molly and Isaac. Did you not just see Molly and Isaac? That was not Molly and Isaac. Ah, here we are, in the cellar. Miss Beverly just saved us. Please, Miss Beverly, I... This is your own fault, Hester. Maybe a night with the rats will teach you how to behave. You horrible child. Whoa. Miss Beverly? Yeah, some tells me those were hallucinations. I'm just saying. Um, hello? Is there anybody there to let me out of my cage? Can I not just, like, slip through? Maybe if I run really hard at the wall, it'll open. It's like a... Oh. I noticed it was broken, but... Now I have a sick key. Hopefully I'm not gonna get grabbed by a big it's demon locked. hand. <laughs> not anymore, it's not. Alright. Hey, Mr. Mr. Hop. Hop. Am I dreaming again? No, you're not. Is Mr. Hop not gonna chase me now? Is it, is it not gonna turn to the first game? Bucket! I can't grab it. This one creepy ass seller. Ow. No, I don't, Isaac. I don't want to play hide and seek with you. Hmm. I see what I must do. And I did it with ease. Ow. That was my bed. I just jumped straight onto that. We just want to play. I really don't. Wake up, Esther. I don't feel good right now, you know? I'm just saying, like... I'm feeling a little sick. I got a headache. I don't think I can play. Hey, 
Hey, look, the I lift. I need to get power to this lift. And now you must play a power mini game. Yeah, why didn't the grandma just like parkour her way over to this power box? Oh, well, that's sad. I could pry this open. You could use Mr. Hops to do it. Sorry, Mr. Hops, I didn't expect you to come at me like that. I have to press E on it. What? I did it. Ah, oh, that's cool. Okay. Okay, I get it. I just gotta be really insanely fast. To be honest, this is the most annoying part of this game. I die, and I have to push a box 47 miles. I try this open. No, you- oh, I hate you, Mr. Hop. Oh my god. I did it. I did it before you even got near me. Now I've just got to speedily jump across every single one of these hands. You weren't, I wasn't supposed to jump there. I, I, I'm not... Mm. Man, I am a parkour master. I'm doing this without even breaking a sweat. Oh my god, I did it. Medallion found. X. I'm an X-Man now. I missed one. Where did I miss it? Oh, hey. There's a the thing that I can use to pry that drawer open. Zero seven one five. Don't grab. Okay. Ooh. That's fine, because Mr. Hop isn't even there anymore. Okay, so it's zero, seven. Go faster. One, five. Unlock. And I can lift myself out of the cellar. It stopped. I suppose this is why the lift was out of order. I'll have to climb. How are we gonna get out of here, though? Because it doesn't. Not unless. Hold on. Not unless I have to jump like this. Oh, I'm a genius. Okay, I'm not a genius. Where am I gonna. Oh my god, the wall. The wall has bricks coming out of it. Maybe that's why the elevator stopped. Maybe these are just some really strong bricks. Ever think about that, Esther? Didn't think you did. But yeah, Esther's the grandma in the first one, I'm pretty sure, so... This would be before the first one. Which might have already been obvious. I don't know when the first one took place, but this one takes place in like 1956 or something. Oh no, okay. Almost fell all the way back down. It's kind of reminding me of Jump King. And that's not a good thing to be reminded of. Okay, I'll go into this dark hallway. Chapter... Wait, no. No, wait a minute. Let me go back. Thank goodness. Now, if I can just get back to bed, I can wake up from all of this. Let me go back. There's more I could climb. I could climb up more. No. I'll just do it later. Hmm. Well, that's not good. Usually that sound means there's a hop nearby. And that definitely looks like a hop. It's not real. No, it is. It very much is. You say it's not real, but I can tell you, you are wrong. <laughs> oh, hey. Special stage. What is this special stage? I don't know, but I just got stabbed. I don't understand the point of this. Okay.
I, I don't know. Oh, I get it. I'm supposed to duck under those. Okay, maybe not duck right where it lands, but I'm supposed to duck under those. Oh, spooky. I haven't seen that before. It's not real. It is. I don't know how you can keep telling yourself it's not real when you literally just saw Miss Beverly die. But it's very much real. This is gonna suck. Really bad. It's not real. You know what else isn't real, Esther? Birds. Birds are just things that the government has created to make you believe that they're real. Oh my god, there's more bouncing pandas on the higher floors. How many floors are there in that? Because it's so hard to actually dodge those pandas. Like, you wouldn't expect it to be hard. You're like, oh, it's, not it's gonna real. be easy. All I gotta do is duck under them. The problem is finding a spot where you can duck under them, but they don't land on you. Because you have to be perfectly at their peak point. That was one hell of an alliteration. Dude, I was so close. And there was another floor. You know, fun fact, Mr. Hobbs Playhouse 2 was not designed to be a horror game. It was actually designed to be a rage game that makes you want to break something. That's what it was designed to be. What? Who, who thought of this? When they were designing Mr. Hobbs Playhouse 2, who thought, hey, I know it would be fun. We have like, I don't know, six symbols that, um, yeah, you know, I have to complete a minigame for each one. And then, uh, one of the minigames makes you want to kill yourself. I think I discovered the strategy. Run straight up to him, duck, and then continue. Run straight, duck, and then. Oh my god, there's another one. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm sorry, this is gonna be the rest of the video. It's just gonna be this. It's not gonna stop. It's just gonna be this one mini game For five hours. I'm gonna be honest, I don't think they played their own mini game. Because who in their right mind would be like, Oh yeah, this is what I wanted. When, I, when we're creating minigames, this one is okay. Oh my god, there's so many floors. Oh my god. Oh my god. You know, it's if you've me. seen that for like, f maybe the 20th time, it's not really that scary anymore. I mean, it wasn't that scary in the first place. A little spooky, but I kind of expected it. And now it's just, it's just something that happens on my way to the actual challenge. The challenge that shouldn't be here. Wow, that's great. That's amazing. I, I love this game. I love it so much. I'm so glad I chose to play this, like, three-hour game for one recording. Wow. This is amazing. Man, if I had to give this game it's a 10 out of 10, it would be an 11. It would be an 11 out of 10. Best game I've ever played. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, my God. That was so close. Suck it. You panda bitch. I bet you, I, okay, I bet you I know where those last two are. I know where one of those are. The other one was probably at the top of the elevator. But I'm so glad I passed that. You sure you want me to go back to bed? You don't want me to follow There's the whispers? Here. Uh, that's not a good sign. It's usually a sign of, uh, we should get out. Also, there's no... What's my new objective? I still have to get back to bed? Alright. I'm at my bed. What? 
You didn't even, like, have a sign that you were coming out of the floor that time. You just grabbed me. What was that? Wow, that was really easy. What is happening to me? I don't know, but <laughs> it's probably not real, right? I can put a stop to all of this. Okay. I don't know where you were or how you told me that, but I'm coming. And nothing's gonna get me on my way. Nothing's gonna get me on my way? Nothing's gonna get me on my way. Hey, D. D. What is going on? Satan. I told you. Satan is reincarnated. <laughs> holes, but I can make it go away and get everyone back. How? Okay. We need to do a ritual. I need nine candles, salt, sage, and the trinket from the second floor bedroom. Hurry! Uh, will do. What do you need again? Oh, nine candles. Hmm. I've alerted the panda? How have I done that? Oh, I see. The panda's on the bottom floor. <laughs> I understand now. They're not roaming the hallways. They are roaming the same spot that I am. What it was? What was that stupid Elmo laugh? I assume some sage would be in here. Oh, here's salt. There's some sage, and there's a thing that I can break. Let me close this over here. Oh, I can't break it. Sad. What would the... Coin. And whatever this is. It's something to make something. Break the... I can't break it. It's sad. I can't break these things anymore. Okay, I thought I could go through that door, but clearly I cannot. I assume Mr. Hops would be on the top floor. Because, you know, he's cool like that. Wait, why? Is the panda the only one here? Oh, nope. Panda is not the only one here. There he is. There's my boy. Oh, he's stopping. He's probably going to turn around. He did not. I think the tiger's coming back. I got everything I need, so it really sucked to die here. Okay, I'm coming back to the library. I'm gonna give you... I'm just into the library. It's okay. Okay, okay. That's everything. What do we do now? We you must sacrifice the other. Die. Oh my Did god. We? She's actually a demon. Oh god, she's killing me! I didn't even notice! I'm tapping as fast as I can. Uh, uh, too late. It was too late. I didn't even notice. I didn't know there was gonna be a tapping thing, okay? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Keep walking and never turn around. Because if you never turn around, we'll both be good. Don't turn around. Stop. I know what you're thinking. No. <laughs> I was so close. Glory and greatness. Now I've just got to walk all the way back. 
No, get away from me. You get I gotta recollect everything now. Because the panda was being difficult. Oh, I don't. No, I kind of do. Okay, okay. That's everything. Okay, can I skip this what so I can get now? straight to the speedy part? You actually survived. D? Why do you kind of look like the old lady? The one who, who died? Beverly? Who are you? I swear to God. What? That better that better have been scripted. I swear if that killed me. Oh my god. You did not just put me in the house of the first game. Oh my that's really cool actually. <laughs> Hey, Mr. Hops. How does it feel to be updated, uh, sprite-wise? Can I see the eyeball thing again? I really like the eyeball thing from the last one. Oh, I can't. I wonder if there's a key in all of the places where the tapes were. That was fast. You moved fast. Oh, here it is. The front door. No, 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 no. Alright. That was cool. That was really cool. Oh, no. Do you not see? This is how it was written to be, to give me a hope to live. Three must have somebody to play with. Alright, Mr. Hops, I see. I may not care, but I see. That's fine. Mmm, the kitchen. The anniversary? This can't be right. Ah, oh, ha, 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 April 2019. The anniversary. Follow me. Okay. Wake up, Bester. No. No, I don't think I will. Yeah, music. Buddy, you're a boy in a big mess. <laughs> No, I don't believe that at all. I believe this is all happening to me. You are perfect. Oh, why thank you. What do you want from me? Your soul. Okay, nothing even happened that time. Oh. Us, no, Where I don't think I want others? to. Like we don't look like I each other. Well, I don't know. Can you explain how my pain feels like? Oh, the, I don't think they left you alone, Esther. This looks like the opposite of alone. No, we don't have your a connection. Pain. So are we inside? My body right now? Oh, well. I don't know what's real and what isn't anymore. What? What? <laughs> Never mind. That must I'm not, not be real. I'm not scared of you, and I'm tired of you trying to wither me down. Play with us, no, thank you. I'll just keep on going this way. Uh, he's coming through the wall. He's coming through the wall. No, I'm good. Stay away from me. I guess I'll go down the stairs. I can't go down the stairs. 
Oh, that was a big mistake. Can I go down these stairs? No, I can't. Where are you going? What about your friends? Nah, they're okay. Um... Did it expect me to go down the steps? I don't know, let me, let me just go check out my friends real quick, I guess. <laughs> I can I can enter the bedroom door. <laughs> I I don't know if this was I don't think this was supposed to happen. <laughs> Where are you going? What about your friends? So I was supposed to go down the stairs the first time around. Man, I'm so glad I know exactly where to go every time. I don't like playing, you know, I feel like I'm a little too old for that. I, I got out of the wanting to play with people qu quite a few years ago. I'm like 47 now. I can't see anything. I don't know what you're talking about, Exit. Oh, hey. That, this is not an Exit. Called it. <laughs> Silly rabbit, you'll catch a cold just sitting there. <laughs> Today marks 67 years since the disappearance of 24 orphan children residing at Blacklands Manor, along with five care workers. To this day, this remains an active missing persons case and the largest in the country's history. Only one child was ever accounted for, but claimed to have no recollection of any other resident. Blacklands Manor was once a large orphanage home in the 1930s through into the 1950s. <laughs> well, that's pretty good. Yeah, yeah, I will find the medallions, okay. Let's get the extras real quick. There's hot hockey. Yeah, I might as well buy all these medallions. Hot Horde? Hoppy Burn? <laughs> oh god. And Hops Rush. There's also cool skins. I'm gonna equip this one. Whoa, wait a minute. Wait a minute, what did I do? What? <laughs> Am I still alive? <laughs> Whoops. Seems to, uh, it seems I have uh, glitched the game. <laughs> well, I forgot to record myself getting the other two medallions, but uh, we're gonna go for all the other endings at this point. Oh. I just leave? I can just leave. There's a coin in there! Anyways, for this ending, you just have to push this stool all the way really, really far outside, I'm pretty sure. If that's not what you're supposed to do, well then this is... It's going to be really annoying and it's going to take really long for no reason. Okay, now I just... Nope. Can I not push this anymore? No, I can't. Oh, I jump on the bush. Oh, wow. This, um... I didn't know our manor just leads straight into void. Esther decided that she had enough of this nonsense, so she ran and left it all behind for somebody else to deal with. Smart girl. Nice. All hell. Can I phone home now? The end. Esther asks a mysterious magic shell what to do about the situation. 
She replied it with nothing. Esther did as was instructed for the spell had spoken. Is this a SpongeBob reference, man? The magic con. <laughs> so to get the final ending, I've got to go through the jump yet again. And then it should give me a different ending whenever I get up to the, like, final part. Whoa! A chapter 9, I think. The Underworld. Where am I now? The Underworld. Set it on the title screen, don't you know? Hey, buddy. Hmm. Didn't know there was green lights to tell me where the stairs were in the Underworld. Big, cool green torch. What's the point of this? I'm sure I'll find a reason for it. Oh, that's the point of it. Now we must find a blue one. Away I go. Found the blue one. Away I go yet again. Oh, forgot that was there. I just gotta... Well, I am, so suck it up. Yeah, that's right. I'm doing all your puzzles. What are you gonna do about it? Ooh, a purple one. Me like. Oh, me no like. What? Click? What was that? Yeah, what did I just do? Okay, now I just gotta get all the way over there because uh, I did it wrong and now I don't have a torch. Oh wait, no, I can just click anyways. I thought I needed a torch to do that. So I can get two pushes in and then it comes down. And then I can get two pushes in. Uh, one push in and it goes down. Two pushes. And then I'm not gonna push it. Now I'm gonna push it. And then narrowly avoid death. Please tell me I don't have to push this any longer. This is the worst thing I've had to do. Stop this. No, thank you. I'll continue doing what I do best. Oh, coin. I love coins. Oh. Here's all of the children from our orphanage. Molly, in hell. Isaac. Everybody's here. No, thank you. Oh, that's not cool. Oh, there's walls. That's cool to know. So is this a boss fight? A cool boss fight? Filled with cool things? Damn. If only I had jumped up a bit. I could have actually got off some damage on that. For the most part. I think I'm gonna die this time. Cause I'm almost dead. Uh, you know, this boss fight's pretty easy. I just stand here. And then explode. Occasionally. No, oh, I'd die. I wonder if I can hit both of them if I do this. I don't think I did. Whoa. Close call there. Now, Mr. Hop spits like highly corrosive acid at me or something. Green fireballs? Luigi fireballs? I don't know. But they damage me, but they can be negated by whatever my uh, pulse attack is. And he's dead. Just like that, I'm gonna beat the shit out of him. Oh no, sucks for suck. Yes, I can. Oh my god, I'm blind. Oh, I think. Oh, my eyeballs. What happened? <laughs> it doesn't matter. Ask Satan. Okay do you want to play hide and seek? <laughs> I do. Yes, but I'll count this time. 
Yeah, way, baby. Where did you get that necklace? What necklace? Hey, look. It's me, Molly, and Isaac. Ah, that's a, that's a dope necklace. There's Ruby. Happy birthday, Nana. Mr. Hops is always here, though. He's always here. Oh my god, he's actually here. <laughs> no, nope. yep, here it is. I don't know why our Nana would give us the doll. Let's test out some of the game modes. Like hop hockey. Uh, difficult. Extremely hard. Am I blue or red? Okay, I'm blue. Well, why don't you suck my hockey... Hockey sack. Oh my god, I am the best at this game. You wouldn't even believe how good I am at hockey. Air. Okay, that was just a fluke. You got lucky that time. Watch this. ba 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 I'm gonna win with this one easy trick. Maybe. I'm, I don't know if I still lose like this. I don't know what I'd do. Come on. Wow. You've got to be kidding me. Okay, you know. Hop Horde. Uh. Start. Shoot, bomb, and insta kill. What's the challenge if I can just instant? Oh, I just wasted that. Alright, this seems like it is kind of challenging. That's what I'm talking about. Max level skills are required for this game. There was, there was a life thing there. Oh, rate of fire. I want that to go up highly. Oh, I see, I see. So this is just like a game that you just get better at. I have a shield now, what are you gonna do about it, dweebs? Okay, it's gone, uh... <laughs> well, what are you gonna do about my ultimate firepower, dweebs? Throw down the bomb, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, no! Now I've got to save up for more rate of fire. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, damn. I have to get another rate of fire thing. More rate of fire. How, many, how high can my rate of fire get? This is really fast. Oh my god, how high can my rate of fire... Okay. I would keep seeing how much my rate of fire could go up, but that's just going to take way too long. <laughs> okay, and then we have Hops Rush. Oh god, it's this thing. It's this stupid game mode, man. Well, it shouldn't be too hard. Maybe. What's the best I can get? Two billion. Especially now that I have, like, Oh, that actually does slow me down. Well, we get the basic premise of Hops Rush. So we'll do Hoppy Bird, which uh, should also be pretty obvious. Yep, it's Flappy Bird. It's, it's just Flappy Bird. <laughs> well, that was Mr. Hops Playhouse 2, which was pretty fun and also a rage game, as well as being a horror game. I also like the Spongebob reference with the joke ending. That was really nice. But yeah, this recording has probably gone on for too long, but that was Mr. Hop's Playhouse too. But that'll be all for now. So see you.